than the uh, national celebrations. And I've been accompanied by my fellow PSS, who also sit with me in the committee. I have the PS in charge of defense, uh, Mr. Mario. I have the PS uh, in charge of roads, Engineer Mugwa. And the PS in charge of sports, uh, Mr. Mweke Jonathan. Now, it's the second time we are physically here to check the level of preparedness and the preparations uh, towards uh, Madaraka Day celebrations. So two things have happened since uh, the last time we were here. Number one is that uh, we have uh, gone ahead and made the decision to hold the event at this stadium instead of Ndukiri for reasons related to time as well as the cost. But then just to give you the assurance that uh, the team that is uh, being supervised by the KDF will be able to give us the stadium ready for the celebrations a month to the time the celebrations will be happening. So already there's a lot of work that is going on. As the uh, governor has indicated, the workshop where they're doing the precast is at the Njukiri showground. And uh, already if you look across, there's already work that, is, uh, that has begun. And we expect that within the next 45 days, the structure will be up and uh, the rest of the uh, Amenities put uh, together. The issue number two is that uh, we have changed the theme of this year's celebrations from universal health coverage to focus on the SMEs, the small and micro medium enterprises, so that uh, we focus on improving the economy, which is uh, one of the biggest challenges. And uh, that then means that for the people of Embu, it's another opportunity to look at how we are able to spur the economy of this county. Not just the town, but the larger county of Embu. And it's also an opportunity because we'll be having so many Kenyans from all parts of the country coming in to be part of the celebrations. And uh, as the people of Embu, we know it to be very hospitable and uh, we are going to have uh, a good, uh, a good uh, celebration. There are other issues that we are going to be discussing with the technical team, just to make sure that uh, we tick all the boxes to ensure that we have uh, good uh, Madaraka celebrations. I would want us to stop there, and uh, we will be providing regular feedback through the Office of the Government.